Hello again, I took delivery of two mini discs, but I can't remember which ones these are from the few that I've ordered. So let's open up and see what's in there. Ah, I know what these ones are. So a quick look, yep, same product code, so these are both match. These are the Sharp Mini Disc 2, hopefully exactly the same. Let's compare those two. Now in an earlier video, I uh, unwrapped these Maxil mini discs. And what I've noticed subsequent to that is that I had a sharp mini disc which looked the same. So I know the origin of these ones. And then I've actually got five of these sharp ones, I think. Again, wrong packaging, uh, wrong case for some of them. But it's five months. I've got a label on it if I can. There we go, perfect. So that's the Sharp and that's the Maxell one. Now I know that's an 80 and that's a 74, but the point is they are the same disc. So we looked at this in an earlier video, so you can go and look at that one if you want me, you know, while I was trying to figure out what's going on. So what I've now done is I've ordered these two, which I believe are the sharp ones. And then we can see that there. Now what I think is happening is Sony manufactured their own mini discs. And I think, I'm guessing that uh, Maxell manufactured their mini discs and then sold them on branded for other companies like Sharp and WH Smiths. Because Maxo is still a plastics moulding company. So my guess is they were producing the plastic mouldings for the discs. I don't know whether they produced the, the actual writable disc inside of it. But my guess is they were actually producing the plastic bit at least. So there's the card. Oh, that's unusual. I've never seen that before. It's a bit plain. The 80 ones, 80 minute ones, came out after the 74 minute ones, I think. There were some 60 minute ones as well. So that is very similar. Now let's look at the box. So that I know is the box from the Maxwell. Take the post in off it. So that's the Maxell box, and this one is the Sharp box. Hard to see, I know. But they have the same cutouts. So it's the Maxell on the left, on the right, should I say. Oh. They've got the same closure mechanism closure mechanism are they the same right, hang on a second so I've cleared a bit of space you might be able to tell that this one on the right is a smoked version of the one on the left so let's make sure this is the Maxell one Ah, no. So that one is the Maxell one. And this smoked one on the left is the sh from the sharp disc. So essentially the same case, but a smoked plastic instead. Now I wonder if the Maxell 80s had the slightly smoke, slightly darker case. Um, so I guess I'm going to have to 
I've got some Maxell MD80s, which I'll open in a, a future video, but mainly this one's the sharp one. I don't know whether you can see there's already a scratch on that case. There it is. So anyway, so essentially the same case. There's the closure there. And the notch, the notch in the mini disc there. Acts on that closure tab there. Or the tab that holds it in. So essentially, and these are Maxell's slide up cases. I don't think there's anything on that box from the shop. Yeah, the packaging for the shop, very plain. Very little on it. And my guess is these came from a bigger pack. So that's the ND-R80 from Sharp. Essentially the same as the Maxell. So another video done, the Sharp MD-R80. Two identical ones, one still wrapped, one unwrapped, and very similar to the Maxell ones. So if you know anything about who the manufacturer of these, of these discs were, whether they were all manufactured by a third party or whether it was in fact Maxell manufacturing them, then please leave a comment. Uh, any other questions or comments would be welcome as well. So thanks very much. Bye.